All right, so on our way to Retro, um, fix the ISO. The ISO was a little too high for the first part of the video I just did. Um, the guys are running across the street while well, they have a fat person who can't walk that fast. Yeah, I'm, I'm dying of like exhaustion over here. We just laid in the bed. I laid in the bed. And it was just too hard. I'm bogging. Don't start. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> you too. So the Holiday Inn Express where we stayed this time, um, my bed was like a hammock. So I talked to the front desk to see if they can fix that. We'll see how it comes out. Hopefully, but maybe there's nothing wrong with it. Maybe it's just a stiff bed. But uh, into Retro Road we go on this long ass walk. So we're in Retro now. Um, I have my camera all out as you could tell. Uh, we are walking around with the VIP passes special. Um, I'm excited to see some of the things in here that I want to buy and uh, maybe mod or hack. Maybe, I don't know, I'll figure out when I get it. But everyone's setting up right now. That's what's going on. We got the crew behind me. They're walking around slowly this time. I'm very glad that you're walking slowly now because now I can actually keep up with you instead of walking <laughs> a fast run pace. Well, put some artwork in front of me and I'll walk slow. Yeah, then, then I'm going to put something in front of you the whole time. I'm like, all right, let's walk. Come on. <laughs> That's not artwork. Let's somewhat Oh, whoa, whoa. Somewhat. <laughs> that is your VIP pass, sir. <laughs> you, bet, you better be walking slow when you're like, oh. That's what it is. So, a lot of things so far I've seen, it looks pretty good. We got uh, some retro games, some retro games, and more retro games. It's Retro Road Expo, what do you want? Uh, they have some shirts over here, a lot of consoles. I'd be looking for one specifically. Um, and we'll see if I can get that. I know I can, because it's gonna be the one I want. Um, Looks like a setup for almost from last year. So I'm excited to see that it's almost similar. Right, Nate? So he's saying yes, he didn't know what the question was. I said the setup is almost as similar as last year's. Not really. It's a little more open in the middle, but. We'll see. Jesus, you know what? He, he's one, one two word person. Bazinga, you have more conversation to this sentence, don't you? No. I can't get he's anything. Right. He's right. I can't get anything out of these guys. <laughs> Nothing. I feel like it's like two sentence McGee over here. Is your mic on? Yeah, the mic is on. I checked it twice. <laughs> also, it's plugged in. I like the last time I did it when I went to the other convention and it came unplugged and I had no audio. So, uh, here's a example of what I might be buying over here. Yeah, I might be getting that. We'll see. Taxi! Taxi! Right there. Zynga, I found it. I found the taxi. They played a little pinball. Still, still fun. I love pinball. Uh, although I will not be playing any more games than Nate or, or Bazinga, because uh, they take too much time and in, in their life and play these games and master it. And yeah, not playing games with them, man. No, not happening. Then there's no excuse if you can't beat me. No, he, he cheated. He, he cheated the whole time. He is a Mortal a, a Mortal Kombat cheat code for Killer Instinct what it was he cheated the whole time not worth it don't fight him 
No. But pinball, I like. That was fun. So we're gonna be uh, walking around trying to see what we can find. And uh, maybe we'll find some gems that I might wanna get, hopefully soon, and go from there. I guess you could say I kind of popped my cherry for a second. I got my uh, my Wii all set with that. Don't know where the guys went to, but um, I spent what 55 hours for in box for a Wii Black Edition, everything included. Now I'm waiting for everything else to open up because I'm looking for what like another controller I could use, and then possibly a GameCube controller, and then possibly a wireless uh, sensor bar. And you got Ahsoka over here. Johnny. There you go. So, as we walk around the, the convention, we'll see what else we can find. I already spent $60. So far, so good. Two games, one system, and Ash Ketchup. Yeah. I caught him. So we walk around, I don't know where the guys went to, but we'll find them in a minute. They're probably around here somewhere, but I'm gonna keep looking because I'm looking forward to finding some new gems. So we'll see what I can find. Note to self, when you see Wii Sports at a convention and you want to get Wii Sports because you don't know if your Wii is going to come with it, grab it. Because apparently it's a hot commodity and everyone wants that game. I had, there's four, four of them I saw and apparently they left. They just walked away. They walked away. He has no idea what I'm talking about. He just agreed to sure it. I'm sure you can find Wii Sports online for like 50 cents. Yes, probably. <laughs> We got all Japanese games over here. Nate is looking at some Japanese games because do you know that he never came from America? He's really from Japan. Speak Japanese. What you call me? I can't believe he said that. So I got my buys for uh, the Retro Retro World Expo. Excuse me, I can't talk. But I got a Switch, and I Switch. I see, I got a Switch on the mind. I got a Nintendo Wii. Got a couple of games. Got GameCube games, which I'll expand upon later. Um, got a couple, an extra nunchuck, an extra controller. Uh, what they called a pro controller in my book back in the day for the for the Nintendo Wii. Um, now for lunch, I got some uh, some waffle fries. I also got a BLT wrap because I want to try and keep it simple and then a drink. Um, it's been good so far for the convention. Uh, hopefully tomorrow I find maybe some hidden gems on the way. Um, I don't plan on buying too much more. I spent enough on uh, what I got. These fries are so damn good. but. Bazinga and uh, Observer, or Nate, haven't got really much yet, at least I don't know of. I'm the one that spent most of the money so far. Um, I'm excited for tomorrow. Let's see what comes of it. So uh, hopefully we uh, get some new buys and some new finds. But for now, I got a controller for the GameCube. I got a controller for the, uh, the, the Wii. I got an extra pair of uh, nunchuck and controller for the Wii. I got to get some batteries next. Um, I got the Wii in box, and I got I got games. So I'm uh, 
pretty much excited right now. Oh, you can see the excitement in my eyes. But uh, we will see what the rest of the day brings up. In my adventure to continue Retro Road Expo, we're going to go visit the convention. This is on day two. I'm probably going to get some more stuff. These guys are trying to vlog before me, but Curry, you look at the time marker. I did it before them. So they can suck an egg. So we're going to head on in. Lie. You lie. I did it. I did it. Nope. I did it before them. That's a lie. Cut. Nope. No cut. <laughs> the convention floor now looking around at some things and uh this gentleman over here i know she has my business very soon but if you look at this artwork right here you'll know why he has my business it's freaking pennywise come on if you guys don't know it yet you need to go on to instagram you need to look this gentleman up on this website Check him out. Awesome artwork. I'm I'm really I'm shocked at how oh god that, that Pennywise just haunts me every time I look at it. I gotta get it. But look look here you go, here you go. Check him out. So I found the game I was looking for. Unfortunately, I cannot talk him down to a, what I call a price that I want to pay. It is reasonable what he was asking for because it is still sealed. But um, I honestly probably end up buying it online only for the fact that why not? Amazon Prime, get it soon. Um, I picked up enough today and yesterday but I'm still on the search, you know, for that hidden gem that maybe someone has underneath the, their, their little display inside of a box. Maybe I can ask them to get. But um, Retro Road has been great. It's been awesome. Photo bomber. There we go. So uh, I'm going to go find the crew. See what the hell they're doing. And then uh, take it from there. So uh, we got my last game that I needed for my uh, buys, I would say, for this year. I got um, WWE Day Reckoning 2. Um, again, these are games that I've loved as a kid. Me and my brother used to play them, and I'm excited to play that later again. Uh, but right now, I'm sitting down by myself. The guys are walking around, but I'm going to have some waffle fries and enjoy myself. So. Nate, what have you bought? Some artwork and something for Marie. Any games? No. We're at a gaming convention. How come we pick up any games? Because I have distinct tastes of things I need. Distinct taste. Yeah, distinct taste. Uh, Zynga, what have you bought? I got some controllers for my for the Wii. Uh, some games for the Wii and the GameCube. Uh, some pillows. Uh, that's that's about it, I think. More pillows for his pillow haven. I, he, he's gonna be buried. I tell he don't need a coffin when he dies. We're just gonna bury him in pillows. I mean, that's why you come in and blurry. But yeah. Um, we're taking a quick breather. 
They're eating. I already ate. They're playing millionaire in the background, but I probably will not win in that game, so I'm not going to bother with that. What is the number one RPG? No. What is the number one RPG, Ben? Super Mario RPG. It's only <laughs> That's the only RPG you need to play. That's it. Forget the rest. I am exhausted, I'm tired, I'm ready to go home, but we have like another two more hours, then we have a uh, a, um, a meeting with one of the guys, uh, a panel, there we go, but I'm looking for a second win, so I'm going to the food court to get some caffeine, because I am falling asleep, so uh, this has been a fun uh, event, guys. I got a lot of stuff. I, I would say a lot more than I normally should have. But um, we'll see what happens when I go home. I get everything set up, see how it is once I uh, homebrew it and uh, play some games on it. All right, so we left the Connecticut YouTubers panel. Uh, oh, good word. Yeah, that sun. Um, Nate over there is uh, kind of focused the camera. I don't know what he's trying to do here. But, um, Nate, what do you think of Retro this year? Awesome. Yep, you get a lot of stuff? Not so much. Not so much? No. He probably spent the West, the, the least out of all of us. I probably spent the most. Um, I, I won't mention it, how much I spend, but uh, it's, it was enough. But, um, we're going to end off the vlog here for uh, Retro Road Expo. We're going to head out, head back to Westerly. I'm going to go get my stuff all set up in my room and... We were going to call it a day. So if you guys like the video, hit the like button, subscribe, comment, thumbs up. There's Steve and Christina right there. Look at that. And here comes another YouTuber coming up this way. There's another one over here coming. There's two. Look, there's YouTuber heaven over here. I got Russ. Look at that. <laughs> this is crazy. Oh, look, there's another one over here. Whoa. It's crapping out. I know. Oh, hey, hey, whoa. <laughs> hey, what's going on, man? It's good lighting here coming through the windows. Yeah. <laughs> so if you guys like the video, hit the like button, subscribe, comment, thumbs up. You know, you know what to do with the rest of it. All the, everyone you just saw coming through all this panel right here, because it'll be great to see them. Uh, Big Bonite 589, signing off.